hey guys, today we're gonna to be opening up uh, Evolving Skies. You know, we're gonna be on that hunt for those two alternative art Ray Quasar cards. This is gonna be the pack, this is gonna be the pack. Chad, do you know what time it is? I saw her again. Where was he this time? He was in a booster pack. He's I mean, he was in a... It was a token pick, but he was in a booster pack. Jesus Christ, Chad, calm down, man. It's hot. <laughs> He's everywhere. Listen, go get some sleep. I'll talk to you at the office tomorrow, okay? Hey, Max. Max? Jesus, Chad, you look like you've seen a ghost. Worse. The little fella. <laughs> Is that all you got to say to me? Everywhere I go, everywhere I look, everywhere on the internet, there's memes, tattoos everywhere! I see him everywhere! <laughs> but hey, I guess I'm just crazy, huh? Well, yes. But don't worry, Chad, I've got a solution. Death? Exactly, but not for us. For him. I get it. Think about it, Chad. What's the best way to kill a meme? Previously, I probably would have said PewDiePie, but he fell off. He really did fall off. The next best way? Monetization. <laughs> so what, we're just gonna sell a plushie and that's gonna make everything okay? It doesn't even look like the little fella. Yeah, well, that's for legal reasons. Sorry, man. I think it's gonna take a little bit more than this plushie to end this meme once and for all. Funny you should say that, because that's exactly what I thought. Boys? Finally, an entire collection of egg fella clothing. Shirts, long sleeve, hoodie, and a plushie. The ultimate cash grab to sour a once great meme with capitalist greed. We're gonna suck this thing so dry that nobody, including you, will be able to think of the egg fella without equating it to the greatest sellout in YouTube history. Well, I do like money. I know you do. But when can we have it online? That's the best part. It's online right now! Who are you talking to? No one. Let's just film this fucking podcast. Okay. Hello, everyone, and welcome to Cold Ones. Man. I like that beer pouring intro. That's a throwback. <laughs> that is a throwback. That's and a the, music, the music, the music. Oh, jingle. yeah, listen to that. Sorry, what is happening? Well, we're recording <laughs> a podcast. Uh, hello, I'm your host, Chad. I'll be your host for the evening and joining me today. Hello, I'm the co host and guest, Max Mofo. Shout out to today's sponsors uh, <laughs> Gamer Subs. <laughs> New waifu cups, head over to gamersups.gg forward slash cold ones, cup of waifu cup. I mean, they sell out pretty quickly, so just buy the energy drinks. Uh, and as always, cool shirts, head over to shirts, Z with a Z dot cool, and use code cold ones for 10% off. We also have new egg fella merch. Ah, yes. That's in the, what's that? What is that? Shut what? up! Wait a minute. What the fuck? I have a little fella on my shirt too. <laughs> what's happening? Your limited quantity, once they sell out, they're gone forever and they're never coming back. You have to go on eBay to buy it. Today, is the two mil special. This should come out a little bit after we hit two mil subs and we're gonna sit down. I'm gonna recap what's happened the last 
year during the pandemic we did Belle Delphine and Sean Evans those were good episodes those were received very well and they got heaps of views but we didn't continue doing remote episodes we fell into just out of circumstance we started doing the videos that are now the most popular on the channel where we sit down and drink and shit and come we've basically just been doing that just because of COVID we couldn't get guests and we don't want to make this podcast like every other podcast we were like every episode should have a featured guest yeah but for now um until we can fly again which might be very soon it might be later we just don't know where the world is still with the pandemic um until then we've just been doing videos and honestly i can't imagine the channel would be as big as it is today without all those videos like yeah there's a silver lining and we're super grateful for what we've got and what we've been managed to do with the channel okay let's have a shot <laughs> let's have a shot all right chad Let's warm things up, mate. Can I interest you in a Smirnoff Blue? Oh, yeah, Mr. Prab. <laughs> Where did we get this one? That was the alcohol bit. The Grog episode. Yeah. So, speaking of episodes, we're going to go through... Speaking of episodes, Chad's is having an episode. <laughs> yeah, I've been having an episode for months, bro. You've only realised it now. This is a cry for help. Hey, cheers to a cry for help. <laughs> I remember that being smoother. <laughs> yeah, hell yeah, it's definitely smoother when you have had a little... Lot. <laughs> What did you drink beforehand? So we want to sit down to begin the episode. We want to go through everything we filmed during the pandemic. Hold yeah. on, hold on. We need to do something else first. What's that? <laughs> well, first of all, let's talk about guests that you want on once we can go back to doing things. Okay, like, see, there's a, that's a double-ended question. Living or dead? No, not dead, okay. Chad. Um, Plausible to maybe happen. Anyone. I would love to have another duo, like Matt Watson. I, I want to redo Super Mega properly. I mean, obviously, Matt hates that episode. Because he just... Because he wants to redeem himself because he thinks he was, like, embarrassingly drunk. I'm, I'm dying right now. Chad, I will literally kill you. What is happening, man? Say one of your fucking skits. Get back to the table. <laughs> I really like the energy of having like us as a pair and then another pair. It'd be cool to get another group. Like maybe fucking Game Grumps or Good Mythical Morning. Yeah, I'd love to take Rhett and Link back to their college days. I don't and know just if they would even drink. I feel like they'd bring like 16 fucking like uh, staff in, assistants, and I'd be like, listen, we'll filter the questions you're allowed to ask them. And they're only allowed to have two beers. And then we kill all the people that work for them. The most requested guests we have are Ian or George. We've tackled this subject a million times. They'll keep asking. We've been over this, but last time Ian came to Australia, everyone got really sick. Have you heard the news? Yes, Ian has super AIDS. <laughs> and there was no time to do a podcast. So we thought we'll give you a little, um... Teaser? What's the word? Teaser. No, not what did you say, Nipple? No, not a little Trial? nipple. Trial? But you got a word for me, Yuri? A crumb? Okay. We'll, <laughs> we'll give you a little crumb. So we're going to call up uh, Ian and we're going to see if he wants to come on the show when things can go back to normal. We're going to call him now? Yeah. Okay. I mean, he might just say no. <laughs> Are you prepared for that denial? Possibly. <laughs> wow, it looks so professional. <laughs> 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 what the fuck? Is he naked? What's going on here? Hello, Ian. Hey, what, uh, <laughs> what are you guys doing there? Does this look very professional? Does it look like we're on the set of Cold Ones? Yeah, it kind of does. Mm. Why does he look like he hasn't what? aged? I think he's sort of hit that like plateau period where he just looks the same now. <laughs> Damn, Ian, you look fucking jacked. I'm lifting every day. <laughs> can, you give, <laughs> can you give us a flex or what? Yeah, what do you think I'm doing? Give one of these ones. There's the Mr. Beast flex. Yeah. Have you been um, doing videos? Uh, no. Why? Uh, I got some big projects in the works. Like for you. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> what the fuck? The owner's like going ham. Yeah, big projects, you know, secretive stuff. I can't really share it. It sounds like, like you a little bit. Yeah, the Japan vlogs are coming. Yeah, it's good to keep them a secret. So if it all falls to dust, you don't have to tell anyone. Yes, exactly. Now, the big question was we wanted to call and ask. When are you coming on cold ones, bro? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we should definitely do a video call. That would be appropriate. No, that's not happening. When we next meet up, is it possible to do a cold ones episode? Oh, yeah. 
Okay, excellent. Let it be on the record. Yeah, that's basically what we wanted to. We wanted to give him a little crumb. As soon as your government says it's valid for me to come, I will. I'll be there on your doorstep. And will you drink a beer? I'll drink a lot of beers. Okay, I'll excellent. Drink you guys. There will be a lot to celebrate, so I'm looking forward to it. You're both getting married. We're both. Oh no, well, you're already married. Well, Ian's a lot older than me. That How doesn't Ian, matter. You, that Ian, does not matter. Ian, can, can you say your age? Is that allowed? Thirty-seven. That is not real. You're not 37. 32? Surely. No, it's 30. Shut <laughs> up. I'm not I that thought it was 32 old. years ago. <laughs> How long do you think until we'll get George on cold ones? Yeah. I mean, <laughs> yeah, that's probably never going to happen. <laughs> If we harass him enough, maybe. I think you need to go through a lot of levels of management to get George. Okay, when's the kid coming? Yeah, where's the child? Oh, yeah, that one might take a minute. <laughs> I'm infertile. Is that real? <laughs> no. I mean, it might be real. I'm not going to try. We should all go to the doctors together and get our sperms tested. That is a good idea. Yeah. yeah. We can see who, uh, we make bets on who, who has the highest count. <laughs> and then we get a trophy at the end, first, second, and third place. That's a good idea. Let's do that when when I when I come. And then, I mean, show up. <laughs> <laughs> all right. We'll mix all that cum in a little jar and like fuck. How about do that? Mix it all together, then donate that and see whose kid comes out of it. <laughs> roulette, child roulette. <laughs> Let's just send all our cum to Twenty Three and Me. <laughs> They'll tell us we don't accept that. It's spit, I... fellas. Yeah. You guys are running a good uh, good show over there. What's your favorite episode, Ian? Uh, I think I'm with the majority <laughs> of people in saying cameo. Cameo? Okay. Also, the Fiverr stuff is great. He is checking his computer right now, looking, <laughs> looking what's been uploaded. Why are you looking over your past your screen? What are you looking at? Uh, I'm literally just fucking looking into my kitchen. That's it. Oh, okay. Yeah. You are looking swole, though. Unironically, you are looking... No, I'm just showing you my fucking collarbones, bitch. Yeah, let's get a good lighting shot, Ian. I ain't showing you shit. You guys are sick. I don't see what <laughs> Oh! Where the fuck? How did you make your camera float? Camera, he's got a drone. It's a drone shot, bro. <laughs> Can you explain the tattoos? Because I never thought in a million years you'd have tattoos. Yeah, that definitely yeah. seemed out of character. Normal people, like, in a midlife crisis buy, like, a Harley or something. You just started getting tattoos. Okay, I'm gonna stop making fun <laughs> no, of your age. Yeah, <laughs> I'm gonna stop making fun <laughs> of your age. I, saw, I got your face on my ass. I completely forgot. It's really quite hard to get these luscious locks correct. I feel it's pain and hate for you. What don't you like about me, Chad? What do I like about you? My good looks? Oh, hell no, you're ugly. Is it bad? The last time that was brought up was when I had sex with someone and got out of the bed. <laughs> and that was. <laughs> And I, because I completely forgot it was there. And I, 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 the only thing I can kind of remember is on my ass is the PewDiePie tattoo. Right. So then they go, whose face is on your ass? And I have to think about it. I'm like, oh shit. Like, which I, one? You've got, yeah. you have your George and Ian. Yeah. But yeah. Ian's is just the biggest one. It's just his face, <laughs> like, plastered smack bang in the left cheek. Anyway, Ian, thanks for thanks for your time. You look like a very yes. busy man, so I'm very busy. Thanks for confirming that you'll be on cold ones when the time comes. Uh, now we just need to yes. lock in George, and uh, you know we'll be set. All right, guys, good to see you again. Bye, Ian. See you, Ian. Have a good sleep. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> man, good seeing that guy. Man, you're so drunk already. Lem. Seg. He's starting to say gibberish. So now we want to sit down and go through a tier list of all the sit down. <laughs> what are you laughing for? <laughs> all right, you just, explain. I'm, no, I was laughing at oh, you. One. I was just looking at the at the, oh. the rank under F. Uh -huh. All right, let me just explain this real quick. We're not doing guest episodes because we don't want to rank like people. So I've put in everything from the Grogged Games playlist as well as our um, solo one meal special because that's just you guys. Okay. All right. So okay. these are all our sit down episodes. And one solo podcast. So we're just going to go through. We're going to rank them and um, let's pick pick the best video off yeah, the top that, of your head what is the best video you've ever done or the worst yeah. air fryer obviously goes in air, air, fryer. Fryer. Where's air fryer where's that thumbnail this video was hands down the worst video we ever did kind of hoping that the skittles will change the color of the popcorn like it's gonna dye the whites of it you remember that colored popcorn you buy in the packets <laughs> the one with the clown on it yeah that one that shit sucks they banned lollies from the popcorn <laughs> But it's still a good video in terms of general YouTube scape. Oh, like, that is true. I mean, th there'd be YouTubers out here that upload dog shit. I think to us as well, everyone was like, you're so low energy because there were so many toxic fumes in the room. I remember going home and being sick for like three days after. That 
that one was actually like detrimental mm. to and we had health. to we had to leave the office while some stuff air fried and come back in and there was one thing at the end of the video that we never showed because how to basic was here at the time and he told us how he <laughs> how he blew up a can on his stove like, i rolled that clip that's literally a video of his sweet and and he said to us, like, you guys got to do it in the air fryer. I'm like, all right. And we put it in the air fryer and we left the room. And we're sitting in the other office and he's sitting down and he's telling us, he's like, oh, yeah, when it blew up in my house, it blew out all the lights and it smashed all glass within a certain proximity of the room, like, of the thing. So we're scared now because around this whole office is just windows. We're now scared that we're going to blow out all the lights. So we're like, okay, who's going to come back in and turn it off? And then Yuri was going to come turn it back off. And we had the security camera up on my phone. We could hear it like going and clicking as it was expanding. Everyone was afraid to come in and unplug it in the fear of it will explode yes. while someone's in here. There wasn't glass surrounding everything above us everywhere. It was also encased in glass. So if it exploded, right. it would have shot glass well, at everywhere. The, at the start, we thought that, okay, yeah, we'll do it on a whim. And then like we had enough time to sit in the other office, in the Cool Shirts office. We sat there stewing like, this is a bad idea. And how long, like, how long were we sitting there uh, for? 30, 40 minutes. It oh, felt like eternity. That was supposed to be the original end to that video. We were like, we'll end it with this can exploding. But after how to basically explain to us like what happens, we eventually came in and turned it off because we didn't want police showing up, fire alarms going off and everything. Didn't we have people like, like who, was it Yuri or someone? No, it was, it was Arthur. Fucking... We were trialing uh, in a system. He, yeah, and he uh, ran the, in. The trial assistant had to army crawl in and unplug it. And no one wanted to come into the room and fucking unplug the device. But I remember we were all so sick from like inhaling crayons and plastic. You were the one that was sitting there the longest just inhaling it like, this is fine. I woke up the next morning like throwing up like bile in my stomach and like it was bad. Which is like not the best thing when it's the worst video on the channel. If that was like the side effect of one of the better videos on the channel, then I'd be like, okay. That's worth it, but for this, it was like, you know, we got the worst video, in our opinion, plus the health side effects. I would just say, my favorite video on the whole channel is the As Seen on TV. The, the kitchen one, specifically. Favorite. I agree with that. I think just because of the sort of cult meme that it's mm -hmm. cultivated. All right, well, we'll just go through now. Fiverr, the Honky for Gaming, the original Fiverr shirts video. I am a trucker and a gamer. The shirt should say, Honk if you're gaming. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is this? This sucks! That is definitely clip art! A for now? Okay. Just because of the history of what it spawned after. The eBay wish drinking video, which is the video that Two Mad edited before we had Prezo like full time. We still get comments that are like, oh, Two Mad definitely edited this video. Two Mad edited one video. And how many edits videos have you edited, Scott? Two. Yes. The only sit down video I edited was like the first half of the first honk, the honk of your gaming one, like the first half. I think. The drinking one is an S. Yuri and I rewatched that recently and it's fucking funny. I remember from that, I think, is the two mad edit with the Skyrim meme, yeah. which I like. And the bird on the head as well. The bird, the bird on, the on the head. Can we please get a bird for the office so we can put it on our heads? I think we should get a cold one's mascot animal. I have AIDS. <laughs> I'm gonna put this on my head. I don't... I can't get it on my head. There's a bird on my head. Put it in A for now. Next one. Uh, the first Christmas one. It was wholesome, but it kind of sucked. Didn't the microphone fuck up for yeah. that one? Merry Christmas, bro. Cass <laughs> <laughs> said she thought Chad would cry. <laughs> what are you <laughs> gay, bro? This one, you have to promise to put it on. It's not gonna fit me. That's a men's medium. That means you need to lose weight. <laughs> Why? <laughs> yeah, he looks kind of lit. You can chuck him on the fucking shelf or something like that. D. I say D. Okay, D. D for technical problems. First Uber video with the delivery driver. The idea for that kind of video was just funny stuff that never came to fruition, which we later kind of amended in future videos. And that one, we got way too drunk. And we, we tried to invite like three other Uber drivers in before Rubinsky got there. And then he finally came in and he honestly saved the video. Okay, so you're gonna review this one. Yep. Don't get it on your Rolex, bro. No, no. Give me money, I eat all ice cream no, if you want. <laughs> okay. Oh yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> there was a story of Rabinsky. He made the shirt. I don't want to shit on Rabinsky, but. <laughs> well, first of all, his name is Rabibsky. Rabinsky. What is it? Rabibsky. Follow me. Follow me. Let's go. Rabibsky. But anyway, Rabibsky, after we gave him like some Instagram clout, he tried to. <laughs> He tried to release like a shirt. It was like the worst shirt ever. Bless his heart. But <laughs> <laughs> it was like, what was it? It was just like a fucking sh a screenshot or some shit. From the video on the shirt. It was like, I'm gonna be an influencer now. This is my one video that I'm in with these people. Buy this shirt. I reckon he would have sold at least 50. <laughs> if you own a Rabibsky shirt, like tweet. an official one. Don't go on Redbubble and make your own. Please send us a tweet. We spoke to him briefly after that video, but then like only a couple of weeks ago, he's like, I'm going back to France. And he left and he was just gone. He was, he kept, was... He kept messaging Prezzo. Yeah, because Prezzo speaks French. So Pre he was messaging Prezzo. That's how I knew that he left because Prezzo was like, oh, he left. It was kind of like a fever dream. I was like, was he even real? Like, did he really get back to France? Or was he just sent here by God? Where do we put him in the tier list? C? I would say B, but... Him trying to sell the shirt? C. <laughs> no, come on. <laughs> He's trying to hustle B. Give him okay, a okay. Nah, C, C. C tier. Next video was the Wish video where we had the crack pipe. That blew us that, up. That, that was like the one up. video that blew us up. Yeah. yeah. That was like our first taste of going viral on the channel, I think. Automatic B. B. And at the time, we constantly just got fucking, um, your packages have been checked by border security for, pro like, there's so many things have been checked or seized. And now I've noticed as well, a lot of packages addressed to this office always get checked. Can I also just say, we are so lucky that that video was able to flourish without YouTube condemning it. As long as it survived with crack pipe image <laughs> in the thumbnail, it just says crack pipe. <laughs> like, that's the thumbnail. Also, um, let, what's your favorite video, guys? We want to include you. <laughs> we can share this template with them so they can make their own and share it with us. Oh, this was a slapper. For this me, that is S. S. That's a that's a straightaway that, S. That came out Hello, of Hello, I'm looking at the camera. Hello. What did Joe do for us, Chad? I made us a lot of money. <laughs> <laughs> I paid for my college intuition. Yeah, Joe was a high point for cold ones. I really like in that Joe edit, the way Prezzo edited it was like, we both came up with the- Cucumber. E each half of the thing were like cucumber, and then you were like, Joe, or something like that. Let's get Pickle Rick on a shirt. Oh, Pickle Rick, is that legal? What's like a one that will fly under the radar that's kind of Pickle Rick? Cucumber Joe. It's me, Cucumber Joe, put that on. I can't remember how it happened, but yeah. Prezzo, if you still got the footage, edit in how it actually happened. Let's get Pickle Rick on a shirt. Oh, Pickle Rick. Is that legal? Yes. Scott said yes while winking. I didn't wink. <laughs> What's like a one that will fly under the radar that's kind of Pickle Rick, but it's not? What's... I'm Gherkin. Cucumber. I'm Gherkin. Yeah, let's make cucumber. Oh, cucumber, cucumber, yeah. You want, you want Gherkin or cucumber? I think cucumber Pete. Oh, um, cucumber Pete. What's another name that begins with P-R? Pete, I don't know. P-Q-R, no. Prill. Uh, no, it can't be, can't be R. I'm Cucumber, what rolls off the tongue? A name that's a normal name. Pete. Like Joe. Pete sucks. Pete? Joe Pete. Rogan? I'm Cucumber Joe. That's kind of good. I'm Cucumber Wumba. Cucumber Joe. Wumba. I'm Cucumber Joe. It's me, Cucumber Joe. Put that on. It's uh, me, Cucumber it's... Joe. Okay, let's do it. That's You're... Joe Swanson. Yes, it's a super, like, um, a super basic, minimalistic, Cucumber in a wheelchair. Okay, I'm I'll, Cucumber Joe. I will let you type this one because this one's, I can't get my head wrapped around it. Let me <laughs> yeah, have a look. Yeah. Well, we're talking about it for a little bit, but the edit was just like cucumber. And then someone else was like, Joe. Yeah, let's do that. Like Pickle Rick. That was awesome. Next one, cameo. Was that the first Gilbert Gottfried that was, This episode? is the first ever one, yeah. Hi, this is Gilbert Gottfried. I'm pissing and shitting and coming. <laughs> this one is for Pootie Pie and the nine-year-old army. I am the cum lord. Marky Plyer is a better let's player. He loves to drink milk. He is so strong and sexy. I'm going to take a shit now, fucker. <coughs> What the fuck? I'm going to take a shit now, <laughs> fucker. This is the first cameo bit, and to my opinion, it's still the best. Because that was our most real reaction to like 
it's like a child stumbling on this thing that exists cameo and being like oh my god you can make celebrities say funny shit and mm. that was like a real reaction to seeing them all say that for the first time well like future ones is more like we know what we how get, it's yeah. gonna go which they're still valid and they're still good but nothing beats the og yeah s or is s that or a i think it's s because it has like presidential aids and oh. yeah it has a lot of stables <laughs> that is that is an s i have presidential aids <laughs> The Wish drinking games. I wasn't a fan of this video. I just straight to see mid tier yeah. for that. The one thing I do remember about it, I'm not bagging on you, <laughs> but at the end you were so drunk. Yeah, and I, I was like, I was like, bro, we need to just get through this. And I remember like the last ten percent of the video took like an hour. I have regressed to that of an eight year old I color like shape, plastic glasses. I was gonna eat that man. The dunk it, bro. Co say Kobe, Kobe. He's like one fucking foot away from the bin. I may be completely fucked. Just push through without being belligerent for the next 10 minutes. Ah! Let's see what sound he makes. Chef! What sound is this? Chef! What sound is this? I have eight. I'm about to vomit. Do not vomit. <laughs> And the next one was our second podcast where it was just two of us talk ah, show. Yes, our clickbait episodes. I liked it though. It was had the animations, it covered everything, it got good views, good retention. That's at least automatic B, B. like 100%. I'll be, oh no, I'll be that. I don't think it holds up against these fucking slappers, but it, it was a good average. It was nice. Testing viral TikTok. Let's see, that's automatic C. I mean, it wasn't bad, it still wasn't as that's good. That's a C for now. It okay. might go D. Okay. Where do you think this video that we're filming now is gonna go in the future? About right here next to this one here. <laughs> <laughs> this is by far one of my favorites. This is the first I've seen on TV where we shoved the lizard cam up my asshole. Ah, that's yes. why I remember it so vividly. Yeah, that Patreon? would be a very invasive episode for you. The part that really stands out to me, as I've mentioned before, is I really like the quality of the lizard cam and how Prezi edited it to be like the 240p with Chinese subtitles or whatever the, the fuck bra it was. No, that was the microphone. Oh, yeah, wait. That, no, yeah. no, that was the microphone. New microphone for the office. Turn it all the way up. Our first streamer video. Oh, that was only Joey D. See what he does with a hundred. He's taking the headphones off. He's put his hand on his heart. He's about to cite the fucking national anthem. Chop your cock off in that fan. Say, what are you gonna do Wait, with the money? I'm gonna help my mom. Oh. <laughs> oh, boy. oh my fucking god. There's another 500. He looks confused now. Give this one to your mom and give her a hug from us. His mom's oh. coming! <laughs> She's been watching. Oh, no. Give him a K. <laughs> <laughs> Take your mom for a cheeky Nando's run. <laughs> Say, give it back. My brother was on my account. Thank you so much, man. Guys, thank you. He's kind of sexy. <laughs> I still watch Joey D. I still tune into his stream and gift him a few subs here and I there. I say... D for Joey D. Not that it was bad, but like... None of the shit we upload is bad, bro. We're the best of YouTube. This was kind of forced. This was like us really trying to... I don't to... think so. I like that video. You did? Knowing that this exists mm. is only further like knocking in the nail that the actual Joe video did really yeah. well. Like the fact that we were able to do an entire video yeah. of people knocking off our merch. What would have made this a higher tier was we wanted to take the full outfit that we got of the all the bullshit merch to we, the shopping centers yeah and stuff so we like wanted that. to wear like the hat the fucking shirt the socks the shoes of all the bootleg joe merch and we wanted to go into like a woolworths or a Coles and buy a bunch of cucumbers with like a lapel mic and we didn't end up doing that which was like the one thing that i was looking forward to doing oh the bell delphine box bell delphine i'm sorry <laughs> <laughs> Let me just say, Chad, every, anytime we say her name in the office, Chad always says Bella. I think it's because his dog's name is Bella. My dog's name is Bella. And she has been absent from the internet since then. I think we may have ruined her career, possibly. No, we uh, just gave her the, <laughs> we gave her the retirement clout. She's a, the reason we have the most viewed video on the channel. I, I was the one communicating with her because I did a couple calls with her and we kind of had some moments. We were speaking and we had some, like, we were having some intimate talks and. <laughs> <laughs> not, not like that. Not Man. like that. Not like that. But we were talking. That woman is like a child to me. Okay. Okay, that sounds worse. <laughs> she's a sister. A sister. A sister. She, she is a sister to me. I hope she's doing well. Yeah. I, I, yeah. I haven't heard a lot from her lately. She's definitely been 
um, absent, absent from the internet. The, the, the reason yeah. why I was on the fence was because she had sent a few of them to other people. Yeah. And I was like, clearly she's doing it for the sake of being popular, which mm. it, which is obviously part of the case, but yeah. that's part of like the marketing genius that she was portraying at the time. But all of but it was- they were high tier. Yeah. They were worth doing a video for. She definitely put a lot of- thought and effort into our packages as mm -hmm. well yeah i'd say a or b bell if you're watching i hope you're doing all right i hope you're alive i hope you're ready to drink the alien head vodka on cold ones one day when we can uh, meet up and do it do a part two podcast all right the next one was the second fiver shirt which was mr breasted any really good fiver shirts come out of the second one that were just like slappers jimmy beast was mr breast it's hard to remember we had a few funny ones there were, we we made a lot with that one yeah so. in the video we were like i hope mr beast is okay with this but before we actually edited and posted the video chad was in dms with jimmy beast and he said something kind of nice i think which afterwards chris in quotation marks the meme god a constant reoccurring character on the show he dm me and was like i love this i want it and i and we sent him one he was like no send more i was like what <laughs> he's like yeah i'm gonna make him wear it and i was like all right we never got a photo of that though, Chris. You promised a photo. Yeah, but there, Jimmy Beast in there. There yeah. was request to get a pic of Mr. Beast wearing the full <laughs> fucking fit. I sent him a pic of us wearing. I said, "Hi, Jimmy, buddy. We made this for a video. It's part of a series we do. We divine five of shirts. Blah 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 blah." And he said, "Go for it. Sell them. I hope you sell a hundred thousand. Lol." Which didn't happen, but. I mean, we sold at least 10, so that's fine. Six sexy Jimmy Beast merch didn't sell as much as we thought it would. Do we still have some of those left, actually? Yeah, we do. Oh my God. Wait, anyone want to buy them? I'm sorry, that's going to D tier. Soda Stream. I don't know. I like the Soda Stream one. We did eggs. What else did we do for that one? Watermelon. We, watermelon. Blue. Oh, that was the watermelon exploded. That was awesome. The watermelon might actually explode. Wait, come here, Max. Feel it. If fizz is coming out of it. No. <laughs> yeah, it's automatic C for me. For See? Now. The second Christmas video. <laughs> D. The next one we wanted to film after this, which might not come to fruition now, was instead of spending it on each other, we, we go were... to a shopping mall and I dress up as Santa. Was that the idea? No, we were gonna go to fans. We we're gonna buy. Oh, our... that's right. Yeah. Yeah. So we we're gonna spend the same amount of money. We we're gonna get a sponsorship. Yeah. We we're gonna fucking spend all the money on buying shit and then delivering it to fans so, and giving them merch. Do a shot with them, something like that. And by the end of the night, we're gonna be so drunk, I'll be pulling up to fans' place like. We brought you an Xbox. Can I throw up in your toilet? It's kind of like a combination of that video that you did, that you and Scott did, where you were delivering- Yeah, why isn't this on the tier list? It's still up on the channel, delivering merch to fans. Yeah. If we can't do it this year, next year, unless the channel's dead by then, we'll see. <laughs> this is the second cameo video, and it was going really well. It was, it was one on one. We were so proud of it. In fact, I would even put it on S tier with the other cameo video. It had some good memes in it. That shit was blasting. That's an A for me. I, I, I say A. It was aye. blasting. We knew that was going to be one of our best videos and YouTube just fucking put the fucking band hammer on it. Was it in the video that we uh, told Tony Hawk to say Tony Hawk from skateboarding? Yeah, I'm Tony Hawk from skateboarding. <laughs> and about he said to no. Do... Yeah. Okay. Hey, it's me, Tony Hawk from skateboarding. <laughs> Drunk painting. This video for me would have been one of my most favorite videos but my microphone was dead. It so wasn't plugged into the camera properly. Put it in F tier next to the last video that uh, fucked no, up I on my- I I like the video. D? D. D? D. D. D's. D's nuts. D's. Okay. No, D? <laughs> will it blend? I like that. Yeah, put it C with, uh, will it carbonate? It's also in C, yeah, so yeah. chuck it C. Second Uber Eats video, F. Fat Bugs Bunny and yeah. Among Us memes. And then you also did finally Pickle Linda. Pickle Linda. I like the Pickle Linda meme, but I don't think that caught this on. Was... That's still D for me. I... We had the guy come in and make the pizza for us. That was funny. Oh, I think yeah. D, that's D for me. D? That's a default D. Didn't the only a spoonful fucking chaotic shit happen in that one? Finally melt. Stop making a mess. The bun. Dipsy butt in the air, boys. Hey, yo, dog, can I get some of that sludge? Yeah, man, but only a spoonful. <laughs> it's me, King Bat! Hey, yo, Chad, can I get some of that sludge? Only a spoonful. It sucks. Give me a spoonful, Chad. I... Hey! Hey, King Batch, collab with us. <coughs> Oi, when you mix in the potion, only a, right. <laughs> only a spoonful! Man, not the Yeezys! Fuck! 
Yeah, look at the Among Us character. Big Chungus. Max, how much have you had to drink? Uh, only a spoonful. Oh, internet challenge one. This video was awesome. It sucks that we had to censor it so much. The only disappointing thing about this video to me was we challenged people to do it. And we challenged Misfits, Super Mega. You think that's disappointing? No, I no, thought no, we let... got a lot of them to do it. They all did it. PewDiePie but... didn't do it. <laughs> PewDiePie didn't do it, but look, he's gay. But... <laughs> Misfits did it properly, kind of. They all pussied out. I mean, we Swagger, were there. And, Swagger and Zuckles killed it. Matt Watson, too mad, they all half-assed it. And then they challenged just random people. Like, we would challenge our cameraman and no one else. It's just like, we wanted it to make this, like, sparring effect where every YouTuber did it. Who did it recently? Who was Off them? Kenny. Uh, their video was pretty good. Yeah, actually, no. Off Kenny did a really good job now that I think about it. But you know what they all pussied out on? The watermelon part, wrapping the rubber bands. Like, fuck this. I ain't because wrapping that's the one. Yeah. that's the one thing that takes the longest yeah. in front of the camera. Yeah. I'll put it B. That was yeah, funny. Okay. That there's, was funny. There's space in B. And I also, the next morning, woke up and I was shitting fucking green i think i had the color mm. green yep and i remember i took a big huge runny dump because i'm lactose and my poo uh, it was just the whole toilet was just green like dark green years of fucking training <laughs> spaghetti <laughs> ravioli <laughs> what do you reckon the cows are doing that made this milk probably being slaughtered uh -huh. Yeah, I remember shitting blue or yeah. some, something like that. Yeah. Oh, I like this one because we set the office on fire. Yeah. Testing the most flammable TikToks. Once again, going into the video, we weren't going to title that. It was just TikTok life hacks. But because we played with so much fire that episode and set the office on fire, we were like, flammable TikTok life hacks. It's a great thumbnail. That yeah. was one where we got the steel wool and I was swinging around. Oh, okay. Yuri, so Yuri that's was like, at space camp, we fucking spun that shit around our head. If we sh turn off the lights, and we put it in a thing and you swing it around, it full, makes sparks fly everywhere. That seems really dangerous. It's not. Swing it around above your head. <laughs> oh ah, no! Ah. That was so hot. No, that's hot, that's hot. That's really hot. Ah! My hair! That was a horrible idea. My hair caught on fire. We learned about this in camping. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, is that Tony Hawk from camping? <laughs> And I was like, all right. And we're flicking sparks all over the office. And one of them hit the rubber curtains and caught it on fire. And then we just sat down and started filming. In the corner of my, in my peripheral, I see this like flicker. And I was like, oh, it's nothing. And I'm like, I double took. And I was like, ah, there's a fire. Uh-oh. In the moment of potentially burning down everything we've built, everyone was freaking out. Max is like, film it, Yuri. Ah. We didn't know where the fire extinguisher was. It was right but in it front was of the fire. It was literally there, right where we put it, right fucking in front of us. And for some reason, we couldn't find it. Yuri, where's the fire extinguisher? Uh, where the fuck is the fire extinguisher? Keep bouncing it with water, Yuri. Oh, fuck. That is not good. Where's the fire extinguisher? Do we have a fire extinguisher? We did. You got it all? Is it out? Ugh. Okay. <laughs> no, that's the light, Yuri. You got it. You got it. It's the light. You got it? Yeah. Right All right, on. fellas. We, um... <laughs> look at it. <the>, look at it. <laughs> look at it. I had a video on my channel where... We set Ian's hands on fire? Yeah, and there was, like... I thought the whole house was gone. I was, like... It, it was the same sort of thing. It was, like, in a panic. Where it was, like, where's the fire extinguisher? It's not fine anymore. Jesus Christ. And I thought I had learned from that that we would never do that again. At the time, when it started burning, we were like, put water on it, which is not what you do with a fucking fuel fire or whatever yeah, the fuck. Spread you can't, it, yeah, spread yeah it. so when, once the water went on it, it, it made it way worse. And so in the moment of panic, you immediately do the shit that you don't think you would do. And then when we filmed cold ones and we had the fire extinguisher on hand, which in the video, we put the, the arrow pointing at it. We still couldn't find it. Well, Yuri put it out by throwing water on it after oh, yeah. you moved yeah, the camera. Yeah, my last water bottle broke. Well, show us your new water bottle. It's always the same water bottle too. I like this video, despite almost burning down the entire building. What Death. Would... Okay, B, yeah. Trying the world's strongest alcohol. No. Another video that did very well for our channel and was fucking blasted. This got, this got us like 200k subs in a month. I'd say A, automatic A for that one. And I remember being very hungover the next day. We got really drunk off that video. <laughs> that was awesome. That's also the video where we had a lot of comments being like, um, <laughs> hey man, I'm from the Bermuda Triangle, man. And that's $2 where I live. That's like 16 cents where I live, bro. You guys are pussies, man. That's a great video. This is where the meme was born. Unintentional meme. Funny skits in the video. That speaks for itself. That's an ass. Yeah, that's an ass. That's that's an ass. I mean, that's why we're here with the fucking merch. That's why we dropped the fucking... The, how many clothing items are in this set? Five. Plushy. And a plushie. Oh. <laughs> Channing Tatum is wearing one. <laughs> Shameless. How many people have gotten it tattooed on them? Okay, it's at least 14. Hey, if you get an egg fella tattoo, 
tweeted at us, you will be retweeted. I saw a lot of comments that were saying like, this is kind of sus how they did the, the shots or whatever. How we did it was once we did the shot of the, hey, this is a little egg fella, we filmed over the shoulder of Chad, yeah. Chad tearing away the paper. I like that. Have a an extraordinary, extraordinary day. That's a nice little, that's a, nice, that's a funny little character. I like that. All right, let's test this out. Hold on one second. Can you get a shot over my shoulder as if you were shooting over my shoulder when I was showing Chad the character? All right, Fresno, put that in. <laughs> Have you seen this little character? Look at that. No. Shut the fuck up. I've seen the egg wave guy. Look at this little fella on that. <laughs> Wait, can you get another shot of this one, Yuri? Is, is that a good shot? Yeah, it's a great Stop! <laughs> no more! And then we just kept repeating him tearing the paper away when it was obvious that we didn't have a natural shot of that. Next! This is the five animations. This was great because the standalone animations, when we like tweeted them and like we shared them with people, like that was just... I don't know, I liked it. I remember seeing the animations everywhere. The best part about the animations was King Batch doing yeah. a tweet. Hopefully that's gonna stem. That's gonna be like a little tree branch that one day we get King Batch on. S. S, yeah. S, absolutely S. Uh, Lush Sucks, spray painting. Ugh, that was another one I got really sick from. Any chance that we get to make something that's not a sit down episode within like the current COVID fucking landscape yeah. is a plus. Yeah. Mm, I don't know, I think B, we originally set up to have the respirators on yeah. because Lush told us that you can't do this without getting paint in your lungs and fucking even touching it and all this yeah, shit. It was very detrimental to your health. So originally we were all going to wear respirators, but then when we came to mic up and do it with the respirators, it didn't work. He was coughing in the video, but there were parts where we were like, Lush, are you okay? Lush has already got like major lung damage from... <laughs> from spray painting all the years, but he went, I remember when we started, like you said, he was like, we must wear protective equipment. Like, yeah, we didn't because we couldn't yeah. because we, for the content. Lush was the unsung hero of that video because he literally, at the end of the video, he was like dying, like coughing his guts up, like almost vomiting. So when it comes to filming, we go health risk or mm. content. We always put the content above. Mm -hmm. I'll, t I'll shed more time off my life for a funny. I like this one too. I like all of them, but yeah. This was the uh, getting free stuff from sponsors when we went on your verified Instagram. We're like, please give us free stuff. Just for the sake of like originality and us uh, gearing away from doing like the, the stuff that we'd done that was already mm. set in stone where we're just doing episode after episode. I think that was like a good where we just did something completely original. Yeah. So I think even for that alone, it's like a guaranteed C or a B. I think B. The gaming chair. Max had the same gaming chair for like five years. It's broken to shit broken. And Max was so excited to get this Razor chair and it sat at the office for two weeks before I suddenly said, Max, I'm I'm getting an air tasker to take it to your house. How long did it sit in your living room before you decided to take it upstairs? No, I left it in the garage. <laughs> Is it still there? No, it's in, uh, I'm using you, it now. How long did you leave it in the garage for? I don't know, at least two weeks. <laughs> So we got a lot of free stuff out of it. And that was that was fun. All right, we're down to the last two, four, six. Okay, let's fucking smash these ones out. Another donation video. We always try and make these work. And it's always the same result. Make someone cry, give a bunch of people money. Or make someone Twitch? suffer. Oh, that too. Or suffer. <laughs> what was the guy that we made drink soy sauce or something? We nearly oh, killed a guy yeah, in the first one. Neck a soy sauce bottle. It'll give you what? $50 to drink a bottle of soy sauce. How about you give me your boy sauce? G give me something else. <laughs> You. Find someone way more willing. Put soy no sauce way, in dude. your beanie now. Oh! Is it leaking for the hat? It's, it's not, not even leaking. leaking. <laughs> could have, could have gotten away with it. I, D tier. I put that in D tier as well. Yeah. Pretend to be Mr. Beast. Yeah. We at least make one person cry each time. I give that him was a good. ridiculous amount of money. He just donated you a thousand dollars and said, "Have a good night, fellas." Fuck off. <laughs> oh, we made no. Is he actually crying? Let's give him more money. How much? Five hundred bucks. Tie it all up. That's weak. Oh, one, 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 one. He's going into fuck. He's paralyzed. I love you, bro. And I. I <laughs> That's so sweet. He loves us, man. Oh, I want to have sex with him. Let's fuck the shit out of him. You were good human. This is the best day of my fucking life. Aww. <laughs> that is so sweet, Chad. Oh. Balls and dick don't even work anymore. He's still straight. We leaked out. This address. was. Is this our first mail video or our yeah, second? Yeah, this is our first. We only done one. And that was funny because we had Cleo and she sent us her period blood. Oh, no, her teeth blood. Her teeth blood. That's still on set. Is what? it? Yeah, you want to smell it? No. I think we still have our underwear down there somewhere as well. That mm. was funny. That once again, <laughs> she could not have answered. If she didn't answer, that wouldn't have been as funny. This is Cleo. Uh, Cleo, hey, how you going? This is uh, Chad from Cold Ones in Max. <laughs> oh my god. How, how you going? Uh, we got your package here. I'm amazing. Got your custom. 
What way? What's in here? Cleo, what the fuck is this? What do you think it is? Did you wear this? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, you have. What's in I, the red bottle? I ain't drinking that. I got my wisdom teeth taken out, so it's all of my mouth blood. I would love you to drink it. Let's send it to a lab. My tongue is a lab. Hold this. Oh, no, no. Finally, the most insane cold ones fan. <laughs> That was very, like, I did not think that was going to happen. Yeah. We got two illicit substances <laughs> in the mail. We got shrooms and we got these weird pills. Oh, yeah, throw them here. We still have them. What the fuck? Let nice. me take those. And we got these weird pills. Which Someone want... told us what they were in, in the, the comments. comments. Yeah. But I ended up giving the shrooms to Fitz. That's, That's not being... <laughs> I'll ask Fitz. He might not care. But I we think end up... he doesn't mind. I don't think he might. I'll ask him. I went to see Fitz afterwards and I took him with me. And I kind of took them to show everyone. And I was like, look, we got shrooms in the mail. And Fitz was like, I'll take those. And I was like, no, we got them in our mail. Like, you do not want to take them. He's like, I'll take them. Fitz ended up taking those shrooms and messaging me the next day. Like, those are the best shrooms I've ever fucking had. They were awesome. Like, <laughs> he's went through every last one of that bag of shrooms by himself. That was also funny. the first time that we had our secondary editor. Yeah, that, that edited was. Edited a main channel video. Yeah. Yeah, Ryan did it. We need to give Ryan some more projects, but that was the first video that Ryan edited and it was great. The overall video for me is C or D. Yeah, absolutely. Right, C or D? C or D. No. Where, where would you put that? B or C. How about we flip a coin on B or C? Okay. I will say my opinion, B, because B? of just the fan interaction and the yeah. fact that it did quite well and like people liked it, even though it was like kind of just generic. It was also fans. very generic. Like, I mean, everyone's done well, a yeah, doing male video. Male video. It's an easy one. Mm, I think it was great. $50 versus $5,000 blindfold alcohol taste test. That one is an A for me. Yeah, I like that too. I really want to do more videos like this. And a. It speaks for itself. Great. A. Speaks for itself. A. Automatic A. Good video. Next, another TikTok life hacks. Man, that did some damage to the office, that one. You still got slime on the ceiling. Yeah, that's still there. I still got slime on my Yeezys. They won't come off. I think this is the best TikTok hack video out of the three that we've done. Okay, so I remember watching this in the office after Prezzo sent us the edit and thinking, okay, he's done a very fucking good job with yeah. that. That's a B for me. I reckon we moved the office on fire down to C and chucked okay. that in B. Yep. Our most recent cameo <laughs> video. D or F. Really? <laughs> nah, it's okay. You, see, the problem with this is you're way too critical of it. I don't like it as much. I, I'd give it a D. That's a D for me. I think it's a C. It's still a C compared to the fucking S and A cameo. It's still a C though. And last video we did before recording Recording this was the fondue one, which fucking F sucked. Right <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it wasn't worse. It was still better than the F. Right. That's F. Yeah, I think it makes sense that the only uh, video in air fryer category is air fryer. <laughs> But if there was going to be another one in the air fry category, it would be the fountain video. Yeah. We fucked around for like three hours trying to get the chocolate fondue to work for the intro. It was literally three hours. Yeah. And we finally got to work and it still wasn't working as well. It just sucked. It was messy and the energy was low to begin with. And I was I, like... Like I said, I kind of took on your role where I kept saying, this is not a video, which is usually what you do. <clears throat> yep. I feel like if I didn't do that and I, try, I was like, okay, it's going to be a main channel video. I'll try my best. Then maybe... Maybe I'd put it up a rank, but I was 100% convinced it was gonna just go on Patreon. Yeah. So I, I'm surprised that it, we, we, it ended up on the channel, but with the editing, with Prezzo's editing, it saved it. F is good, I think. Now that you're looking at everything that's been assembled, do you have anything that you think needs to be changed? I think Soda Stream should be moved up to B. Other than that, I think that's looking healthy. Anything in S you feel like doesn't... Nah, that no, S is that's good. that's good. That's our final tier list. Let us know in the comments if you disagree with this. And also we've left the template or whatever link to do your own one tweet at us uh, let us know what your tier list looks like i mean what are we gonna do with that anything shove it up our ass well yeah we might shove it up we'll our look ass. at it no we'll look at it that's more of a look thing we'll chuck it in the group it's chat more of a look thing we'll put it in the group chat well, you will receive nothing please oh, do nah. it you we'll will receive do a couple nothing. retweets and likes what do you want to fucking do you gotta print them out put them on the wall on the next maybe the next one will uh, next video will be like hey this one guy made this tier list we decided it's okay <laughs> Let us know. Put it in the fucking Reddit. Uh, yeah. The community can decide. Man, we are very critical of ourselves. Oh, like how many Ds there are? What the fuck? We fell off. There's only two Fs and one air fryer. <laughs> 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 but yes, um, thank you guys very much for watching. Buy merch. 
give money. Oh yeah, and thank you. Oh yeah, this is a two mil sub special. <laughs> thank you so much for two mil subs. Um, as always, we do a cheers to our get yeah, Scott. Get us some drinks. Get a cheers. Yeah, mate. get us some shots going, eh? Tequila. Okay. Breaking out the good bottle of the old TK tequila. Yeah, thank you guys. We have reached it faster than we thought we ever would. We didn't think we would get here as quick as we did. We've grown way faster than we thought we would. Yeah, I was kind of hoping this channel would be dead so I can just go fucking rot and play WoW. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm just joking. I think we're con yeah, we're constantly trying to be like, let's let's improve ourselves. Let's top let's top fucking everything that we're doing over and over and over again. It's very difficult to do so with the sort of handicap that we have on us with COVID and shit like that. But we're doing our best <laughs> to two mil. To two million subs. It's Thanks, guys. <laughs> Can I have a chase after this? What is this? What am I drinking? <sighs>3 million subs I'll Joji <laughs> Yeah leave that in